main thing that helped me in college algebra was taking notes. Cause at the beginning of the year, I didn't take a lot of notes. I just thought, you know, I can think, remember it mentally, but that didn't work out so well. So I started taking notes and like, I went from like a real low grade to like a high grade, like a B. So I think note taking is very, really, very helpful. I think uh, doing practice problems at home and as well on the board, So you, li you like going to the board? Yeah. It makes, I don't know, maybe because the teacher's up there and you feel like you know stuff. I don't know, just you sit back at the desk and you like, uh, and you just did it on the board. I think staying after the tutor will help you a lot. And especially if you don't get it, then the teacher and get that one-on-one -on -one help and you leave. Oh, another thing is when, um, okay, Mr. Powell, uh writes notes on our test. Please look at those. Don't just ignore them because it's going to come back on something else. Because not your For real. Look at what he's saying and ask questions if you do not understand. Just Good luck. Don't have any emotional distress and don't stress yourself. Oh, one thing. Do not fall asleep in class. Don't fall asleep. It will not help you at all. You can wake up and you can be like, what the heck is going on? Right. Never fall asleep. You won't wait for and everybody is gone. The world will end. It'll just be you. And <laughs> sit at the desk at all times. No, you don't have to. Yes. My you advice. Don't get class. Advice, be comfy. Don't you sit. don't come to school, make sure you get your butt to this class. Lounge in the chair. But I think most importantly, you should have fun and make the best of it. Yeah. Don't trip off one grade. Bring, always bring your books to class. And a calculator. I'm just no, you don't need a calculator. It makes you dumb. It makes you dumb. That's what my dad said. My dad told me if I use a calculator, it'll make me dumb. And since then, I've never used a calculator that much. What are you talking about? Y'all still be using my calculator. But I don't need it, though. But you can use it. I use it, but I don't need it. Anything else to add? All of it is great. Study hard. Do your homework. Do math every day. You'll be successful. Math is healthy for you. It's like milk. All the buy attention to chapter P. Just don't be. Okay, my name is Allison, and my number one piece of advice: stay awake during class. 
as much sleep as you can the night before. Doesn't matter how much homework you have. Try to um, organize so you can be on top of that. But please don't sleep during class because it really does make a difference. The teacher kind of has a lot of important information to share. Yeah. Hello, future college algebra students. My name is Erica Watson. My piece of advice to give you will be to take notes and to stay focused in class. And that's in any college class. How about you guys? Um, I, I guess since I, I did so good this semester or year, whatever, on uh, college algebra, next year I plan not to, uh, to lay back and just be lazy and get on that work, you know? And also, once you give them your homework, you better do it because then you get behind and behind and it's hard to catch up. And if you don't, then it's hard. So yeah, you, you got to make sure you do your homework the day it's assigned. Because it'll it'll help you because then you when uh, when you don't know how the question works you can the next day you can then come back to the teacher and ask him for help on how to finish it and um, also I say pay a lot of attention and take really really good notes and study right before tests. On the count of three, say study. One, two, three. Study. Do not make up an exam. There's no extra credit. Yeah. So don't put things off? Yeah. <laughs> you agree? <laughs> that, would, that would hurt your grade a lot. a lot. And don't stress too hard. I mean, do your best, study, do what you need to do, but don't give yourself great hairs over it. I mean, yeah. yeah it's a, one thing is to have fun. Yeah, have fun. Learn. Math isn't that bad, especially when you have a school. Yeah, you can always <laughs> take the class over if you need to, but hopefully you won't have to. <laughs> And you got to make sure to ask questions on stuff that you don't know because you don't want to move on to something else that will use that uh, that lesson and not know how to do that either. And it'll be like become even an even worse situation. So you're lost in the whole lesson. Yeah. Your questions are important. Oh, and talk to your classmates because a lot of times if you don't understand something in class and you don't have enough time to talk to your teacher, um, definitely talk to your classmates. A lot of times they take notes and they might be able to help explain things differently than the teacher did. They might be able to help you better. So have study sessions with your classmates if you can. What about peer tutoring? Any of you guys peer tutors or go to peer tutoring? Yeah, I'm a peer tutor. Right there, back. Well, I was. How does that help or help you as a student or help other students? Well, I do have one advice. Uh, when you're doing the P chapter, you want to pay the most attention because that's the chapter you would use throughout the whole year. And every section, every other chapter, you would use the P chapter. I just want to say that if you build off of the P chapter, that is your foundation. And if your foundation is not strong with the preliminary chapter, then you're going to crash in that. So how did you organize yours? Not well. <laughs> um, I would procrastinate a lot and I would have many late nights staying up, which would result in <clears throat> power nap sessions during um, <laughs> college algebra, which I do regret very much. <laughs> so don't sleep and try to organize. And it's cool because we can like mark it up and it helped me because I can like highlight stuff that was mentioned in class and and all our other books, since we don't own them, we can't do stuff like that to it. So I like that.
So you like the fact that you, you, you own these books now, you can take them home? Yeah, yeah. and then find it to brush up on this 